In this video, I will tune my PID loop on my Ender 3 S1. Hello makers and welcome to another 3D Hub video. My name is Mackie. Uh, today, PID tune natin tong Ender 3 S1. Uh, ano yung PID? Uh, PID stands for Proportional, Integral, and Derivative. Yan yung system na nagko-control ng temperature ng hot end tsaka ng heat bed. So, if you change something like heater cartridge, thermistor, or even nozzle or heater block, naapektuhan yung stability ng temperature. Fortunately, pwede natin yung i-auto-tune using the uh, feature sa Marlin. Kaya lang, wala siya dun sa control panel. Para ma-access natin yung feature na yun, kailangan natin i-connect yung 3D printer sa computer and then run a program. If you're using an octoprint, pwede rin doon. So, let's get started. So first is connect your printer to your computer. I'll be using printer face. Yung download link ilalagay ko dun sa description. Pwede nyo ring gamitin yung OctoPrint uh, just using the terminal. Once you connect your uh, printer to your computer, just open your uh, printer face. And then choose which COM port your uh, printer is connected to. In my case, uh, COM4. And then click connect. And then we'll send M503 click send and then makikita natin dito yung stock PID setting here ito yan to execute the PID auto tune magsisend tayo ng command M303 ayan yung code para sa PID auto tune E0 represent the extruder Pwede nyo ring i-PID tune ng bed pero ang ilalagay nyo yung i-negative 1. So, in my case, yung extruder lang. Space S220. So, yan yung uh, temperature setting ikakalibrate nya. And then C5. Ito yung number of cycles. So, may mga nag-auto tune ng 5. Merong 10. Pero sa akin, yung 5 is okay. So, just click send and this may take a while to finish so after the auto tune it will give you the corrected PID setting here so we're gonna set the system so by sending M301 P copy in lang natin tong value na to And then click send. And then we need to save it sa EEPROM. To do that, send M500 para masave sa EEPROM. And then send. So we can check it later. I use 220 on my auto tune because I normally print between 205 and 240 depending on the filament I'm using. I think midpoint is okay and that's how you uh, PID tune your 3D printer. If you're new here on the channel, you might want to click subscribe and the bell to update you on the upcoming video. Until next time, I'll see you on the next video.